Today's video is about Keretonu, a place with one of the oldest dams in India and with thousand year old temples. Keretonur is about 130 kilometers from Bengaluru. But we started our journey after completing our hike to Kuntibetta. The 30 minutes drive from Kuntibetta was through the countryside and we passed through many villages before we reached Keretonu. As we entered the village, we saw Sri Nambi Narayana Swami temple on our left side with a huge lawn in front of it. Built during the 11th or 12th century, this temple combines the architecture of both Hoysalas and Cholas. We can see some inscriptions in the temple, but it's hard to understand what is written here. As you can see, the temple has a large courtyard and it's very peaceful here. On the opposite side is Sri Gopala Krishna Swami temple. The outer walls of this temple look very similar to Sri Nambi Narayana Swami temple, but the pillar in front of this temple looks very interesting. temple is also built during the 12th century, though the priest mentions that it dates back to 5000 years during Dwaparayuga.
Interestingly, we can climb the terrace and see the top view of this temple. From the temple, we drove towards the Tonnur Lake. On the way, we saw the statue of Sri Ramanuja. This lake is called as Apsarikatte. Behind these hills is the Tonnur Lake. That's our next destination. fills this lake. It is said that this lake never goes dry. We visited in the month of March and there is still a lot of water. There are many small temples next to the lake. It also looks like a major religious location. But it's sad to see a lot of garbage thrown around. This looks like an outlet of this dam. Yeah, though we cannot enter this section, we can see the water gushing out of this outlet. Thanks a lot for watching, see you in the next video.